Today we will review a nice device. Like every time. We got a box from Amazon with a nice Prime Day Amazon ribbon. Now we are open to see what it is. Always be careful when you open it normally that you don't go too deep because you will scratch it. What we have now here? Oh, a smaller package. It is a dash cam. I thought my wife just get the driving license and so it will be <laughs> a nice uh, a nice device to observe her driving <laughs> so, I will go to a festival too and I want to to, to move it away there 750 kilometers. Okay, this dash cam is from Amazon, something around 160 euro. Good. Uh, features is you have a small screen at the back so that you can see what you move and you have a second cam at the back so that you can moving uh, you can uh, record the front and the rear also inside of the car what is the reason for it the reason is when you want to park it has a function who deactivate the cam and when there's a moving around it will activate automatically so when you are not in your car and you park and somebody will bump your car, it will work out automatically. Some of the cams have an um, acceleration uh, or geometer inside. they detecting some vibration and switching on them. But this one is um, uh, really a visual control. Mm -hmm. I mean, uh, the surrounding is uh, visual control. If something moves, it will switch on already. A very practice on the festival or two where we'll put it in the car and when we are on the festival uh, we can observe our camp if somebody get our beer or whatever <laughs> yeah that is very important okay. uh, so we can we have a little bit of control but if we catch somebody on camp we have to catch him also on real but uh, then we finally we know if somebody start to drink our beer because we have a 50 liter barrel and you cannot look inside so <laughs> so okay let's open the only thing is if you want to use it uh, in, 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 in park mode you need a uh, power supply with continuous powering the, 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 the cam and I think this cable is not included but uh, it needs to 12 volt there's a special adapter with a battery I think but I think you can finally do it by yourself very easily uh, in when you connect and you connect an um, an external 12 volt battery to your charging, it will work too. So the ribbon is open. It's very nice pack. It looks the packing looks very very quality. Uh, went through. I don't know. Never hear of it. But normally the most dash cams are around 20 or between 20 and 60 euro, but they don't have this function and uh, I don't trust very cheap products. Uh, that's why I decided to do a little bit uh, higher one. You can also put in up to 200, I think 200, 256 megabyte chip. The chip is, I think, not included for this price. Uh, right, we will see. So, let's take a look inside the package. <coughs> we have a lot of books. Quick starting guide, share, Facebook, follow us. Uh, and here also a small description, what the screen, the ODE, the, how you call it, OED means, how to setting the dates, to capture, you can also take Pictures and and and, but we will see that later. Let's come to the cam. The cam is here packed in this nice. It's it's well, it's not really big, but it's also not really small. It's uh, I decide for this design because um, the other one is long and big. And when I want to put it in the side car, 
and the side window then is it good when it uh, is like that so that is the cam we have a small uh, a small 1.5 inch screen with some buttons and touch touch functions here's the rear cam with some infrared uh, with some infrared you can turn it a little bit to adjust it and then you have here the front lens uh, it's also infrared is that the infrared what you see um, there is the connector to hang it. There is the SD card slot. Uh, some buttons at the back, at the downside. Normally it's like this. Yeah. Oh. Here is the USB connector. Uh, there's also a reset button somewhere. There's a microphone. You can also uh, record the voice inside. So now let's take a look for these accessories. They are in a second, second tiny box here. Oh. Accessory, also nice packed. So what we have, we have here this sanction for the window, uh, we'll just clip in here. Very nice made is that when you use this device, you don't need to plug your USB here because you have all the contacts here and you can switch it there. So the cable is not hanging inside the window, which is very nice. This is also with a ball head, you can adjust it in all the direction. And also you can have a safe block like this. You will glue it and then you tighten it to, you know, to have a good hold. Um, let's try what how it looks like when we put that together. Just like that. So you can put it on your window the way you want. Wow, well, it's, it's it's not uh, it's not tiny tiny, but it's quite nice. I saw bigger already. And nice is that you have a screen, so you don't need a cell phone to connect, uh, to watch what, what, what was recorded or whatever. So, that here is the cables, I guess. We get a USB cable. I guess that is for update, maybe also charging. We'll see that later. And here is the power cord. Because that is with the adapter here on the with the light. It's not a button, it's a light. Uh, it uses also this micro with a micro USB, not nano, I would also not see. Uh, it's a, an older plug, but a more la more longer lasting plug, you know. It's the old one, the bigger one, but they had space so they use it, it's also maybe cheaper. But as I know from the description is, if you want to power it continuously, you need you need this with a battery pack. Because the problem is on your car, the cigarette lighter, which just fits in, um, is always just powered while the ignition is, mm, is active or uh, several time later, 10 minutes, and then switch off automatically. And there's no, no built accu inside. No, that is really, this device needs an external power. That is not a standalone or something like that. And for this reason, you really don't need them if you want to use this park, parking function where you record them when somebody will uh, move in your surrounding or like we do now in the festival uh, ground when somebody comes to our camp uh, while we are not there. Uh, we need an external power supply. I don't know if it will work over the USB, uh, but I think it will because normally the USB have five volt. That means here's a here's a converter inside, and the device works with five. So you can also connect normally a power bank. Uh, we can try it if my wife will give me a power bank. We can try it uh, fast. 
because that will be very nice. And you don't need a 12 volt battery or something because there's an uh, accessory you can buy um, to connect here. Well, that is the bed that the cables were included. <coughs> this is the description how to make. You can use an 200 oh, no, 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 house power plug. Ah, yeah, here. Yeah. Yes, I think that is a power bank. I don't, I don't under, understand Chinese or Japanese. Wait, I have to switch to the. Ah, here yeah, is it. That is German. You can use a normal power adapter for home. You can use the 12 volt for the car and you can also in an energy or power bank. So that is good. So I guess my wife have to give me her power bank. Wait, my husband. Uh, small update. This is not for the SD card. This is a sensor or something. I don't know. Uh, because here at the side I saw I should read first the manual. <laughs> There's a uh, rubber cover and there you can put the SD card and you have also additional uh, micro HDMI. So it means you can also connect directly in, in a small TV or something, a small LCD screen. That is very nice. So, okay, let's, let's uh, power it uh, over the adapter here. Um, we can plug it in here. And then we will use this this power bank, it's a normal standard power bank. We connect it, and we see it will start automatically. And it will show you immediately. I'll remove the the cover. It will me show show me immediately. It is very nice made. Uh, it shows you the picture in the front as a big one, as the main picture, and the rear as a small one. You see the cell phone on my face. <laughs> so, and that is very nice made. There's then some information of the display. Um, yeah, the time, the date, uh, that it's connected uh, to an external power source. Uh, HDR recording, automatic flash, but it has no flash, but uh, uh, there's then the video mode, 1080p, uh, it's a full of HD, you can switch it to full HD too, but it will consume more power. Um, I will put this away. So, so and now it, uh, here's the record, I think, oh, it should be, I don't know, here you can see, here you can switch off. Uh, the OK button is to start recording and to go to the, the setup. Um, and you have you have to enter. It's not a touch. You have to use the down. This is then the OK. This is the back. You can then uh, yeah. You can adjust here. This, here's for example the parking modus. The parking record mode. You know. Now oh, this is the enter. Oh. Parking mode and then OK. Ah, OK is there. Now, now I switch it off. It's a little bit cool, tricky because this is just to forward, backward. And you have then the, the red marked buttons. They are then this one. That is a little bit. So we go to record and then buy this. Uh, Parking mode, okay. So and then you can switch it on, for example. Oop. Now the parking mode is on, and we start automatically recording when something moves in your car. That is uh, very nice, made. So, well, it's a nice device. I don't have an SD card now, uh, but I think we will review it then uh, while it's working when we are so far. Um, yeah, no, for the moment, no, this M is too back. Yeah, back. You can have also OK, you enter the menu, and then you can system set up, GPS set up. Ah, GPS is also included here. Yeah. Yeah. You can make a trace route. You can see later on the map where, where you where you was. 
So not good function if you want to cheat your wife, but so. <laughs> when you go so to rate it, one uh, to ten. Yeah, also for the first impression, when I have to rate it, the price is quite okay. The quality, it looks a little bit, not really heavy, but today there's no aku inside, so, uh, but it looks very uh, nice made. It's uh, also um, well, it's, uh, it's still Chinese made, I think, but still um, it's a nice product. And I guess uh, I, choose, I choose the good one. Uh, for the wait, for the when I have to wait it right now, like this with all the excess accessories, the only thing maybe they can give you a starting starting up a SD card, thirty two or sixty four because they are not so expensive anymore. It could be included in the package. Well, uh, that's why I will wait it for the moment. Also, alone from the looking, from the packing, everything, I will wait it uh, nine from ten. Nine, wow, yeah. almost. But Perfect, huh? Almost. Okay. Yeah. The, 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 the SD card is missing. So. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. You know, customers always want more. So, <laughs> but um, have to add more euros. Nice is that you can really connect it without the sanction that you can take it off. Uh, maybe you can also get other accessories. I don't know. Uh, you maybe can adapt it to a stand. You know, you can use it in a selfie stick or whatever. Um, but about the quality of the recording, we have to try it first. But uh, for the rating of this, I will give 9 from 10. Okay. So. Yay. Okay. Thank you for watching. We could be continued. Yeah. No?